Hello, it's me. Today I am doing a unboxing for a trade box <clears throat> that I did with the Border Geek. I sent him a lot of stuff and I will post a link to his video in the description of what I sent him. He wasn't expecting all that, so he was kind of surprised. But when we're talking, he's all, he mentioned a couple things that I might like, which I already had so he mentioned something about some treats and I'm all well you can never go wrong with treats so I'm pretty sure he sent me some treats which I'm kind of hungry right now so I want to get this box open he did send it in a <laughs> Huggies wipes box so I'm thinking he either thinks I need to wear diapers or I need to wipe my butt more <laughs> but I don't know and how he would know that, I have no clue. I know he did say he felt bad that his box isn't going to live up to my box that I sent him. Which is fine. He didn't know I was sending all that. But like I said, you can never go wrong with treats. And I am hungry. So, let's get it open. My daughter did say that I had to save her some. She went over to a friend's house tonight. But she might not get none. He did say it's treats from Canada. He is from Canada, hence his name, The Border Geek. Some paper. I don't need paper. He did put a note in here if I can get it open I'll read it and you know he's a teacher because he put the date on it so what's up crazy hope this package finds you well down south like the box I used or like the box I used not sure that anything in here is as good as the girl girl guide cookies it's supposed to be girl scout cookies you love but i tried by the way i apologize that i couldn't figure out how to include more star wars in here that you don't really already have cheers the border geek and he's got a little his own stationery with his logo on there let's see what we got in this box First thing I see is something I was really hoping he'd send me if I can get it open. Jeez. I think I need my knife. And that is his pen of the Border Geek of his logo. And the backing, the card backing is of also off his page and logo. It has his YouTube and his Twitter thing. And they are numbered. I got number 16 out of 100. It's right there on the back. I'll take a closer picture of this. It's actually really cool. It's double pin. And it's got the plastic stoppers on the back. Or holders or whatever you want to call. Really like your pen, man. Right. Close this up before I cut myself. Right. He sent some treats. First thing is from Nestle coffee crisp never heard of that sounds good though then there is from Cadbury crispy crunch never heard of that one either he did say these are all from Canada there is Mr. Big are you trying to say something you saying I'm Mr. Big <laughs> These are 
cheesies that looks like uh they look like Cheetos. Jeez, you put a lot of stuff in here. There is some maple cream cookies. Those are kind of like Girl Scout cookies. Definitely be trying those out. More paper. More paper. Here's something with a note. It says, have another beer, eh? I don't drink beer. But I will definitely be putting a Dr. Pepper in it. It is a Empire Strikes Back koozie with Boba Fett on it. It's pretty cool. I don't have a can handy or I'd put one in there right now. And there's one more item. On my period with the Peep Geek, hey? Well, here's the ugliest figure ever made for you, crazy. I would recycle him if I were you. And that is the Stan Lee Soda something. Soda Z? Soda Sodas? I'm not going to open it, but... Stanley, like in a soda with uh, arms and legs. It's still sealed, so <laughs> I actually watched you unbox this. I am really looking forward to eating this stuff. Thank you, Derek. Appreciate it. And you did pretty good. You got something Star Wars in there. I'm proud of you. But I really want to eat this stuff, so I'm going to go ahead and go. I will put a link to his channel down below. Make sure you guys go check him out if you haven't. Subscribe to him. He's a pretty good guy. Like, comment, subscribe. Till next time, stay crazy.